Okay, so if you have thyroid issues, it is because you either have an autoimmune thyroid condition or your thyroid just isn't getting the nutrients it needs. So here are some ways you can support your thyroid naturally. So the first one is selenium. Adequate levels of selenium reduces the risk of autoimmune thyroid, believe it or not, and can also lower your thyroid antibodies, which is super important. And so you can supplement or you can also get selenium by eating a few Brazil nuts a day. The next option is iodine. So the thyroid needs iodine to function, but equally too much iodine can also lead to autoimmune thyroid disorders. Um, so like with everything, you need to be on top of it. So I recommend about 150 micrograms, um, and that's generally the guidance. And I find one drop of Lugol's iodine in water a day uh, does the trick, but this will depend on your situation. So again, be on top of your thyroid levels, understand what they mean. And you can also eat seafood, kelp, sea veg, etc., etc., to get extra iodine. So the next one is vitamin A. Now, we used to get heaps of vitamin A when we ate the whole animal because organ meat contains high amounts of vitamin A, but we don't get enough now, and deficiency affects the thyroid. So it's a fat-soluble vitamin, so it will absorb better when you're getting enough essential fatty acids. So that's also important. So omegas, the next one, they help you to absorb the fat-soluble vitamins a, D, and K, as well as doing a bunch of other amazing stuff for your body. Now, we need essential fatty acids every day. Our bodies don't make them. That's why we call them essential. So next is B vitamins, and they're usually low when you have a thyroid issue, but it is important to know two things with B vitamins. Number one, always take the methylated version, not synthetic. That will ensure absorption and also that your liver doesn't get overwhelmed with it, so methylcobalamin instead of the synthetic version. And second, that you don't get too much of it. So again, keeping up to date with your blood results is really important. And you can also get B vitamins from leafy green veg and red meat, so consider those two. Of course, it's really important that you take a personalized approach to this, as I always say, as I've said already, so just to know and understand your thyroid levels and work with a homeopath or a naturopath to help balance it back out. But these options will help with that also.